His nickname was The Conscience. Russell Maryland was one player who worked harder, put forth more effort, and as a result, made himself into a Hall of Fame player. Maryland's drive was apparent soon after he arrived at the University of Miami. When, when Russell came to the University of Miami, uh, you know, the one thing that obviously blatantly stood out in my mind and that I always r remember back was, was what a terrific athlete that he was in his feet. Uh, uh, he came in as, a, as one of the most unheralded individuals into any program and, and uh, his great work ethic really stood out as a freshman. I don't think I've ever seen a freshman take more responsibility for the destiny of his career than Russell Maryland did. Second down and nine. Play action. Gardner goes down and fumble. Maryland falls it. Recovered inside the 10 by Miami. With the Hurricanes, Maryland was one of the outstanding defensive linemen in team history. He recorded 279 tackles, 25 for loss, along with 20 sacks. And in his senior year, he won the Outland Trophy as the nation's best defensive lineman. But perhaps the most special thing about Maryland was how he helped everyone around him succeed. He had phenomenal leadership skills. I think everybody on the football team, his nickname was The Conscience. I mean, he had everybody else's best interest at heart. Uh, phenomenal work ethic. Uh, you know, he was a great practice player, a great weight room guy. Uh, you could count on Russell uh, to, to really set the tempo and provide that leadership for everybody in the program. In 1991, Maryland was the first choice of the NFL draft by the Dallas Cowboys, where Butch Davis had the good fortune to coach him a second time. I was fortunate enough to, to coach him not only at the University of Miami but also with the Dallas Cowboys and so uh, he made plays, uh, he, he, he's a, a, to a large extent he's one of the reasons I'm the head coach at the University of Miami is he made me a good coach but uh, uh, some of the things obviously that Russell did, the bigger the game regardless of who the opponent was, whether it was Notre Dame, whether it was Oklahoma, whether it was Florida, Florida State, uh, all those big games you could count on Russell Maryland to make big plays. Uh, tackles behind the line of scrimmage, flying to the sidelines, uh, making a tackle on the perimeter. Uh, you know, he just really played well uh, his entire career. And success has followed Maryland in his career. Between the Cowboys and the Hurricanes, Russell has earned five championship rings. When you've got Russell Maryland on your football team, you've got the complete package. And every single football team that he's played on, from the Cowboys to the Raiders to, to the Green Bay Packers, uh, he's the same kid that he was uh, you know, 10 or 15 years ago when he started his uh, college football career. He's a great guy and, and one that certainly, I guess, the, probably the best word is that he's a winner. Tonight we welcome one of the greatest defensive linemen in UM history, Russell Maryland, into the University of Miami Sports Hall of Fame.